Hello, everyone. Wow, that's a big face. Look at that, Mr. Stearns. You got a big head. You got to be more humble. All right, guys. Thanks for uh, working really hard today with our guest educator. I really, truly appreciate you having my back as I take the day off to get my shot to have your back. Do you understand how we have each other's back? It's a two-way street. Think about how you handled today. Did you have my back while I was gone? I'll bet you did, didn't you? Thank you. Today was a really, really, really important lesson. Okay, today we talked about social structure and we've talked about that in Egypt and we've connected it to the United States as well. And the connection to Gandhi and nonviolence. I wonder why Martin Luther King Jr. bringing it back to our study in the United States in March right now. How does our study connect with Black History Month? One way is Martin Luther King. I hope he had a chance to kind of think about that or at least start to see that connection between Gandhi and Martin Luther King. Okay, Gandhi was one of Martin Luther King's mentor or someone he looked up to and probably inspired him with his own nonviolent um, protesting and leadership, right? So think about that. When you have leaders in your country, maybe in the future, that leader will inspire other civilizations to become stronger, more united. Remember the pencils with the rubber band around it? That's what I'm talking about. Okay, so I want you to really think about Gandhi and MLK, because in about three weeks, we're going to watch a movie called The Children's March. Okay, um, I believe it won an Academy Award. And if you connect it to Hinduism, it will make more sense and be more meaningful to you. So you can kind of step back and see your own country through the lens of a social scientist and then make your own decisions and choices as that influences your um, behaviors in the future. Okay. All right. School connects to your life. If you let it have a good day. Thanks for having my back guys. Don't forget to finish your um, ISN 112, the right side, and then immediately upload that. Okay. To Schoology ePortfolio. Have a good day guys. I hope to be back tomorrow. If I'm not, we're going to follow the same pattern. You know where to go. Have a good day guys. Bye-bye.